everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we will be traveling around Ukraine. Woo! It's really exciting for me um, because it was a country that I called home for a little over two years. So I hope you enjoy um, my vlog around Ukraine as well as a very special ceremony for me um, and which is the close of a chapter for my life in Ukraine. So I hope you like it and this video is a little bit different than my other videos because I'm not going to be talking about a book that I want to read about Ukraine um, because I will make a special video for that because I've read so many that I literally love so much. But this is just a very special video uh, for me all about celebrating my love for Ukraine. So, ya lo blu Ukraina y idemo! chapter's over and it's just like time flies man when you get older <laughs> but um but better she yeah what you joke about the moya uh school who but she's up to me so yeah did you just now yeah more you uh yeah more you'd say much less but it's about this now it's more so like it's a good do you have a sally you have any chance to me yeah this is not what it will be i tak samo z moja a, najkraši podruha, Marija. A, mi žele razem na dva roki v Brševci. I, um, like, ja skazala, što ja hotela skazati do nej, ali ja duže džačna z nej i na 
Tad Rock is the name of the coach. Um, yeah, and like I want to thank my mom and my brother. <laughs> they are like my everything. They honestly like. My mom and my brother are like two of the most down people I've ever met. <laughs> like, I like if I went to Antarctica, my mom would get on the next flight. That's just <laughs> who she is, and I'm just so grateful to have them. Like I remember when I spoke about Peace Corps even, and I was like, "Hey, I think I want to do this for two years." And my mom was like, "Sounds like you, yeah." <laughs> we we were ready for this moment. <laughs> so they've been really. Um, really amazing and just like I've met so many wonderful people here uh, in Ukraine like not only like staff and everyone here is just like amazing and also like volunteers like our group is bomb like <laughs> it's fantastic like I love each and every one of you for everything that you do and just you know it's been such a journey and it's crazy because I came here ready to just, you know, do my thing. And I met someone I never thought I would have ever met. I don't know if you know. <laughs> <laughs> um, And I'm so grateful for you. Like, I honestly, like, I'm not going to cry. So, yeah, there's that. <laughs> like, I'm really excited to start our life together. And, like, I'm just, I'm really happy that I met you. And I know it's, like, they, in some ways, because... I wasn't even supposed to like come here. It was just a happy surprise. Um, and I'm so blessed to have you and I'm excited to start our life together. So. Thank you all for everything. <laughs> Um, all right, yeah, so it's been almost three years since I got here to Ukraine. Group 50, September 2016. Um, I remember when I, when I first applied to, to Peace Corps Ukraine, it was 13 months before I ever arrived, and I just knew I was not applying to any other country. Like, Ukraine was my choice. I was so inspired by my Don, by everything that I saw that was happening, Ukrainians fighting for... Um, you know, their rights, for what they believed in, the future of their, their country. Um, I knew I wanted to be part of that in any shape and form that I could. Um, I want to say, obviously, thank you to Nia, because she's been my rock and my solid these last, uh, these last two years. Um, we've had so many adventures together um, in Ukraine and abroad, and I'm very much looking forward to, to uh, our, next, our next step uh, in the future. Um, I want to thank everybody in Krasilev, my site, Duja Duja Diapo Yuvong, um, all the English teachers, everybody who came to summer camps and English camps and everything, um, everybody who showed me around and cooked borscht and helped me when I was sick or wasn't feeling well. You guys are all amazing. Um, Peace Corps volunteers. First, I got to thank my cluster for helping me survive training. Chuckums here, Courtney, <laughs> Caitlin, Jerome, you guys are awesome, never gonna forget you. Um, group 50, you know, we went through a lot, love you guys. Group 51, for adopting me as well, <laughs> you guys are awesome. Um, every single one of you uh, is an all-star. Um, Peace Corps staff, I can't thank everybody enough, every single one of you, with whether it was language, integration, just, stupid questions I had. You guys were amazing. You guys were the best. So from the bottom of my heart, I thank you very, very much. Um, I want to say thank you to Ukrainians as well, just giving me the opportunity to be here, to work here, to learn the language, the customs, to have vishivankas and eat salo and learn how to cook borscht. It's all, it's like something I'll never forget. Um, the ability to work on the things I was able to work on, whether it was flex, um, whether it was helping Peace Corps Ukraine become more diverse, more inclusive, um, you know, working with, with Nia, the, the rest of our diversity working group, um, and the other volunteers who've all, who've all stood up um, to make Peace Corps Ukraine um, as great as it can be. Um, I want to thank Michael for all your leadership, um, all the work that you've done here as well. Um, and 
yeah, I just want to thank everybody again, and it's, it's going to be an experience I never forget. Um, we have an exciting journey these next few years with uh, with um, both our experiences with with the fellowship that that we're going to both be going through, and then eventually the foreign service. So um, I'm very very excited, and uh, you guys are welcome to Austin anytime. Stay with us.